Hi, this is Sunil from Learning Lad with a video tutorial on C programming. In this tutorial, we're gonna see the static storage class in C. So I'm gonna explain you, you know, what is the static storage class, how to use it, where the variable with the static storage class will be stored, what's gonna be the default initial value, and uh, you know what's gonna be the scope and the life of this variable with the static storage class. So now we're gonna see you know where these variables with the static storage class will be stored. The variable with the static storage class will be stored in the memory. Most commonly it is the heap. Remember, not in stack is a heap. And the next thing is you know what's gonna be the default initial value. The variable with the static storage class will be assigned with a default value of zero. So unlike the automatic and uh, register storage class, which contain the garbage values, you know the variables with the static storage class is gonna contain a value of zero. Next, what's gonna be the scope of this variable with the static storage class? So the variable with the static storage class is gonna be local to the block in which it's been defined and the variable with static storage class is gonna persist between different function calls so to demonstrate this I'm gonna create a function in my program so let me call it as uh, void inc which stands for increment I guess okay inside this um, function I'm gonna create a code block you can see here I'm using uh, to curly braces and within that block I'm gonna create a variable with the static storage class so to as in the static storage class to the variable we need to use the keyword static then the data type in this case it's gonna be int next the variable name let's say X and the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna check the default initial value of this variable so I'm gonna use a printf function it's gonna be print if and um, percentage D and comma X so I'm gonna save this one and I'm gonna call this uh, inc function in my main function so I'm gonna copy the name and paste it here okay execute compile and run you can see here the default initial value is 0 and the next thing is you know this variable with the static storage class is gonna persist the values between the function calls so what I'm gonna do is um, here after this printf function we're gonna increment the value of x so I'm gonna add x plus plus which means you know x equal to x plus one this is a shortcut way and next uh, we're gonna call this increment function two more times so I'm gonna compile and run you can see here 0 1 2 it means that the variable x has persists between the function calls that's because it has the static storage class and the next thing is you know this variable uh, with static storage class will be local to the block in which they have defined so if I refer this variable outside this block it should produce an error so I'm gonna execute compile and run you can see here we got the error it says X is undeclared so this is it guys this is about the static storage class in C so thank you guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash learning lad and um, yeah see you in the next tutorial